Aquarius. Okay. So this is going to be a monthly reading for the month of June. We're about to figure out what sign it's going to be for. Oh, Libra. Okay. Straight to point. <laughs> for Libra. We didn't have to go searching. So Y'all don't got to go searching. It's right there. Whatever it is that y'all looking for is right there. Or the cross watcher. Whatever y'all looking for is right there. You know I think I keep... Anyway. Anyway, Libra. <laughs> Libras, what's going on? All right. If y'all are new to my channel, for the old ones, just bear with me. Okay, just bear with me. But for the new ones, <laughs> I am Ginevra. Okay. I, I'm eating some cashews. <laughs> I'm a mama's. Okay. So, from time to time, I might have to yell, shut up, be quiet to my kids. Or my, my little one might come run up to me and I just got to talk to her for a little bit okay i try to keep it under a minute just for y'all to know also if i ever start this reading singing and y'all like what the fuck is she talking about why is she singing you cannot sing for nothing <laughs> i am so sorry if the message is in the song okay in the, the song most likely 98 percent of the time ties into the reading okay and i will tell you oh my god I will tell you what song it is so you can go listen to it for your own reference, okay? But you'll see, most likely, how it ties into the reading, because I will explain. Um, I play Pandora in the background, so it's not like no set playlist or nothing like that. It just plays off of the gender, and right now, or the genre, I meant to say the gender, the genre. And right now, it's on R&B and Soul. So it's just playing all the songs as R&B and Soul songs, period. Okay? Um, one other thing, this is not a personal, so it will not fit with everybody. Take what fits, leave the rest. Take what fits, leave the rest, okay? Do not embody this reading if it's not your reading. If it's not your reading, it's not your reading. Check another sign in your birth chart, any other sign in your birth chart that sticks out to you. And also, what else was I going to say? Flip flop the rose. I could be saying Libra, but it could be the cross watcher. I could be saying he, and it could be a she. I could be saying queen, and it still could be a man. So you be your own leader of discernment when it comes to these readings, Okay? Somebody, I'm going to put it like this. Behind the surfaces, somebody might be thinking that they got something. Okay. Now, if you go to the doctor and they say it's not, if you don't got nothing, don't keep stressing yourself out thinking that you do. I don't know why I need to say that. For some of y'all, it might be another issue that's causing you to think this. Like um, a skin problem, a flare up, or something you know what i'm saying for some females i don't know why i need to say this though somebody might find out they got like um b bv is it bv or vp um ba the bacterial shit that sometimes we can get if we our ph balance is off balance we use in certain things that we're not supposed to um but it don't necessarily always have to come from having sex what is the name of that thing it could be from anything. It could be like your underwear. You could it could irritate you and it cause your pH to be off. And sometimes you can get it sexually, and sometimes you do not have to get it sexually. I think it's B B V. I'm pretty sure it's that. So some of y'all, it's a situation where it's like that. It's just how a yeast infection. A lot of people don't know this, but a man can have a yeast infection and give it to a female, or vice versa. Um, some of y'all might get a yeast infection. Y'all might think your guy got it. They know, bitch. I mean, I like that. <laughs> you didn't got that yeast infection because you didn't wear it to your your clothes today or something like that. Y'all get what I'm saying? So just keep that in mind and just go get that checked out. For some of y'all, y'all might actually have something. Okay, I don't know how that ties into some of y'all. Some of y'all probably already know y'all do, but that's y'all business. Y'all know how to handle that and do what you do. If it's something that you can't handle, you know there's medicines to control certain things and blah, 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 blah. I'm not a doctor. That's not my business. Y'all know what to do. If y'all don't know what to do, sooner or later, I'll put other people up on my channels. But right now, I gotta see who really rocking with me like that. So I wanna include in my business. Like, okay, you can re refer people to people. You get what I'm saying? Okay. <laughs> I'm not a doctor when it comes to all other stuff, so I'm, I can't be recommending all type of crazy stuff. Give me one second. I had to close my door. All right, Libra. Somebody is so over somebody. Wow, trust and believe, and it could be over maybe an STD. 
lucky, but I said at the bottom of the deck, and right now this person is just focused on their six of wands and knight of pentacles, okay? Somebody's just focused on their public recognition, success, and manifesting their money. Somebody's focused on growing their money at the time being. It could be somebody with Leo, with Leo and um Earth in their sign, Capricorn, Taurus, possibly Virgo. Um but somebody just focus on their public recognition, their success, and their money at the time being for the month of June 2021. Spirit, universe, ancestors, show me what's going on in week one. Week one for my Virgos. Oh, no. Y'all could be dealing with a Virgo. Somebody with Virgo in their placement chart. Come together. You might want to come together with somebody. Um... You, you might want to come together with somebody, possibly with Leo in their chart, because you see that they, they have, like, because this Six of Wands is dealing with public recognition success. So they somebody might see that, oh, this person is, like, publicly they, they, get, they, they can get, they're getting successful. So somebody's like, dang, I got a little money, or vice versa. This person might be wanting to come to you, or you might see this person got a little money, and you got the success, or they got the success with the public eye, and you got some money. So somebody like, damn coming together we got it boom money in the you know somebody's like we should come together we should make something work as a team oh let me see that week one because you and somebody's out of sync you and your lover you could be dealing with a cancer you and somebody's not seeing eye to eye at this moment we're gonna clarify all this at the end Show me week two. Show me week two. Show me week two, please. For my Libras. Ten of Cups. Damn, bad. Even though you and this person is out of sync in week one, week two, you are going to be emotionally satisfied. Week two, you're going to be very, very happy. You're going to be very happy. And you're going to be emotionally fulfilled. You might even feel like whatever happens in week two, it's like you feel like you got a family. You're content. Some of y'all, y'all could even be going with family, going back to family or being with family. So this is why you feel so happy. You feel so content. Show me week three for my Libras, please. Somebody sees somebody as family. Show me week two. I'm sorry, week three. I'm sorry. Show me week three for my Libras. Ace of Wands. Eight of Wands. And two of Wands. <laughs> Whoa, shit. Six of Pentacles. Yeah, you ain't gonna be single no more. We should come together, babe. So week three is gonna be a brand new opportunity in an adventure something that you're passionate about this could be a job or this could be a person period but you see this six of wands this public recognition success that comes from this new this brand new beginning in week three with whether it's with somebody a fire this is five years this is all fire whether this is a fire sign or whether this is um a business or an adventure you know what i'm saying something and it's gonna come quick it's gonna come very very quick Somebody's going to send a message to this person very, very quickly. Somebody's going to take action over this very, very quickly. But I feel like from week two, once you get to, once you come together with this situation or this person, in week three, y'all just going to start making action. Y'all going to start making shit happen fast. And whatever it is that comes fast and planning, it's like, you y'all going to be planning for the future. Like, y'all going to be able to look at, y'all going to be able to see the future very, very clearly. Y'all going to have y'all back to turn to the past y'all might even be going on a vacation somewhere on, on the real but this look like somebody is somewhere else off on vacation on the somebody about to plan a vacation or everybody be planning something like y'all y'all gonna be somebody gonna be straight that's what it looked like leave the door open yeah like y'all gonna be living in a neighborhood where y'all can leave the door unlocked and open and stuff because the security and the police don't play they gonna come quick that's what i'm talking about that's what i like <laughs> like y'all get what I'm trying to say in the hood y'all can't do that type of shit they gonna run up in that motherfucker but somebody's gonna be able to mm. okay anyway show me week four show me week four for my Libras show me week four for my Libras show me week four for my Libras 
the ten of swords in reverse they're healing they focus on getting these swords and this betrayal whatever that betrayal was where you couldn't you could not believe it you're gonna be able to you're gonna get up out of it okay because at one point in time you was acting like you didn't see what was going on you were acting blind to everything that was happening around you y'all could be dealing with an air sign somebody with air and water in their chart a gemini somebody with gemini and cancer in their chart that somebody is like, I see clearly of what's going on now. This way, somebody is feeling defeated, feeling down, out, hurt, putting up a defense mode, putting up a blindfold, acting like they can't see, they can't hear. No, that's not what's going on. That's not what they're really doing. This way is, oh, yeah, I see exactly what the fuck is going on. I see what you're doing, okay? And I'm not hurt over it no more. I'm healing over it. I see exactly what's going on. Oh, baby, don't keep me waiting. <laughs> Look, somebody. <laughs> I'm going to take a step back, though. Because in week three, somebody is going to. Somebody is waiting for somebody to send a text message. And they're going to send that shit very fast. And they're going to get it successful also. Somebody is going to. From week three, I feel like week three is going to be some, like, SCX that is about to be off the chain. Off the chain. Somebody is going to get excited off of something y'all get what i'm saying let me just show y'all what i see somebody's gonna get excited they got like, oh i need this i want this okay they might be looking over the internet over something to see somebody and they like hold the fuck up i need to send a message very fast i need to send a text message or something and you see this person holding the phone in their hand oh they're gonna get that message they're gonna get that they're getting it that text message whatever it is it's gonna get it's gonna get got and it's gonna get sent and it's gonna be they meant what they said and it's about to be some action taken quickly okay and it's gonna be enough <laughs> sexual healing to the point that somebody is no longer feeling hurt and defeated no more like week three is gonna get the job done <laughs> for somebody that's so funny and show me the outcome no you're not about to be single no more if somebody feel like they were about to be single they not because in week two they already know they thought they hunt they thought they found me they was just playing around with somebody that they shouldn't have been playing around shouldn't have been playing around with this person is not your soulmate at all but just somebody also gonna be worried if they have enough money to like <laughs> get this situation going somebody's kind of scared with this nine of pentacles in reverse somebody is questioning whether or not they got what it takes but you do but somebody also sees that this fire sign got a lot of options a lot of people gonna be on this person this could be y'all y'all could have fire in y'all chart but a lot, it's a lot of competition it's a lot of suitors a lot of people watching this person yes i need to take a rest Ooh, somebody it's something hidden because somebody for sure for sure on the low is still conflicted over this person whether it's y'all or somebody else who fucked the world according to your situation. It's somebody else in the background. And somebody knows that somebody is hiding. Something is hiding from something is hide something is hidden from someone. Somebody is breadcrumbing with the six of pentacles. Okay, but somebody needs to take a break from this person, from this flighty energy coming in and out from these options. Somebody needs to not do that because that could bring that was at the bottom of the deck that S T D as well. All these options. Let's clarify now. Two ways. Somebody goes both ways too. Clarify. Not like it's a problem that you need to protect yourself if you're doing that for sure. For sure you need to extremely protect yourself doing that. And you need to be honest. Period. Um, but somebody feels like this is a two-way situation. Somebody is one-sided. With this two of cups in reverse, especially somebody feels like the love, the give and take in this situation is off balance. I'm not getting what I'm giving. Okay, somebody feels like this is a one-way situation, but this is a two-way situation. It's two people in this partnership, not just one. Clarify the six of wands and nine of pentacles. Four of swords. Yeah, somebody is going to be able to rest. Oh no, it, it, it turned in reverse. So somebody is not, somebody needs to rest. Somebody needs to heal. Somebody needs to recharge themselves mentally before they get exhausted. Somebody's public recognition and fame and money. This sounds like the last fucking full moon reading I did. Didn't I say the full moon was going to bring? 
anyway, somebody feels like since somebody's been getting some recognition, success, and a little bit of money, they ain't been able to rest. They ain't been able to take a break like they wanted to. But I see that somebody's going to be able to take that break. You need to because you will mentally burn yourself out. And that's not good. Stress will attack you in ways that you may not even feel like. Like it, it might just hit you out of nowhere. You don't want that. Let's clarify this one more time. Clarify this six of wands. Oh, that's too much. Emperor in reverse and the four of cups in re four of pentacles in reverse. So somebody is not, somebody is unstable all over the place and just spending. So somebody, and it might be because of this public recognition, somebody needs to like get back in control of themselves and take a break. Start stacking and saving your money. But I feel like being in the public eye and having all these options got you doing shit that you ain't. You need to just stop. Take it how it goes. You or this other person. Somebody could be trying to show off and, and, and to people that they it ain't even that necessary. It could be your partner that's doing this, trying to show off and act like they something. They're trying to prove a point that should not be trying to get proven. Y'all get what I'm trying to say? Like, who cares what they think? Who cares? Anyway, clarify this. Week one, two of cups in reverse. Clarify the two of cups in reverse, please. That was great. Eight of cups. Somebody is walking away from this situation because it's no longer fulfilling them. No longer fulfilling them. These cups ain't getting filled with love no more. It's empty. That shit is shallow as fuck. Clarify. Okay. Week two. Page of cups. Somebody's about to get their feet wet. Somebody could be also got somebody pregnant. For some of y'all. <laughs> but somebody is like sending somebody a message like, Hey, I like you. I want to get something going with you. I miss you. Okay, because that's a message. And then in week three, we see that message get sent very fast because somebody is contemplating and they send that shit. In week three, it takes the fuck off. Some truth and some clarity is about to come through for somebody. Clarify this Ace of Wands, Eight of Wands, and Two of Wands. CPR. You help me feel alive again. Baby, where would I be without your love beside me? Oh, then I say this love, this action that gets placed is going to heal somebody. Week four, you're going to forget about your hurt and your pain. Baby, where would I be? They feel like somebody feels like this person's love is CPR. They just revive their ass from the dead. Do you understand what I'm saying? Because it feels like CPR. Might it help somebody feel alive again? Clarify this ace of wands, eight of wands, and two of wands, please. For my Libras. No one understands me, but this person understands you. You're the only one I can find in. You are them. Take it how to apply to your situation. Clarify week three. Stop playing. Why am I trying to clarify week three? I gotta pull out a little deck. The Hermit in reverse, period. This person brought you alive again, brought you up out of this feeling down, out, defeated, depressed, hurt, shutting the world out. You not talking to nobody. You was depressed, doing some soul searching in isolation mode. Damn, I really hate feeling alone. Maybe you can make me feel at home. I'm trying to tell you. So this person brought you up out of this. This person is going to bring you up out of it. This person could have Virgo in their chart. You could be. I hate feeling alone. Somebody hates feeling alone. Clarify we core. Clarify we core. I need you here at home. Somebody's gonna be choosing, but like, I need you here with me. Okay. You're the only one who knows. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, you gonna heal over this baby mama? Y'all can have a baby mama that's very manipulative. They just use their emotions to get a hold of you. They might start crying a little bit. And you're like, don't cry. I'm going to stay. I'm going to stay. Or however it goes. But somebody is about to heal from this heartache and this manipulative ass person. This emotionally manipulative ass person. Clarify this outcome. The nine of pentacles in reverse. 
clarify the outcome. There's nine of pentacles in reverse. What is this? Nine of wands. I don't feel like that was supposed to be there, but it's fate is not. Somebody's going to get this situation. Somebody is hurt, but they moving forward, period. But they feel like they don't even got what it takes, but they going to do it. You going to get it. The universe is going to take care of you. As long as you do what you got to do, period. Clarify the nine of pentacles in reverse. Clarify the nine of pentacles in reverse. This is way too many. Seven of Pentacles, you just got to put the work in. You just got to put the work in and invest in the right way. Lovers, period. This is a soulmate bond. This actual person, no one. No one can compare to what the fuck y'all about to get going. It's going to be kind of, you're going to be, that's how with every new beginning is scary. That's the first major account of a fool because it's a scary situation. You don't know what you jumping yourself, what you headed, and put, what you, you don't know what you're getting yourself into. But it's okay. <laughs> because the universe got you. It will only get better. You and me together. Through the days at night. I don't worry because everything is going to be alright. What the fuck did I just say? People, people keep talking. They can say what they like. But all I know is everything's gonna be all right period like no one's gonna be, be able to compare to this situation show me what's going on with the libras please independent that's that nine of pentacles somebody's being somebody's independent somebody's gonna be out independent on their own but they scared but it's okay because you have somebody whether this person is not gonna this person might not even be your actual lover this person could might be your lover or your friend you get what i'm saying that it might grow into something better it might be your best friend it might be a business partner that somebody is here to assist you through this situation they're here to assist you and they're really here to help you and heal you okay y'all probably gonna help to heal one another but you're independent and you got this shit okay this person could even probably put a love spell on you through sex and it was manipulating you through your emotions. Sex. They put a love spell on you. I think I already said this with Libra so many times. <laughs> Show me what's going on with the Libras. It could possibly even go. Then I think they go both ways in the beginning. They could possibly even go both ways. So they always brought like another person in the bed. And they're trying to like satisfy you and keep you there. But like that shit kind of got old after a minute. Because you just started seeing through this person. Like you bullshit or something. I really don't know. But guess what? This is the test. It's a lot of he say, she say shit going on. But guess what? In the near future, what's going to happen in the near future? So I can end this. What's going to happen in the near future? What's going to happen in the near future? Show me what's going on with the Libras for June 2021. Ooh, stand your ground. Self-care. Wishful thinking. Travel. Do you. Unfinished business. No matter how far you go, I'm going to be close. Okay. So that's the tricky part. Remember I said that somebody's going to be traveling, probably even going on a vacation. I showed this card, so start planning now. You and this person is going to be doing it good. But this other person feels like there is some unfinished business. And they're going to try to trap you and keep you attached to them some type of way. Especially this is a baby mama or baby daddy. So you need to get aboard and stand your ground and do some self-care, self-healing. So that this person does not phase you. Oh yeah, go to the water. Go to the water and heal and pray, period. Because you got an ex that ain't going to try to, they ain't going to leave. They ain't, they ain't trying to go nowhere. <laughs>